So lately I've been watching some prepping videos talking about the usefulness of having an air gun in your supplies in terms of economical pest control. The ammunition is very inexpensive, so it's also an economical way to practice your marksmanship and weapons handling skills, that muscle memory, and you can also take small game with many air guns. So that all made a lot of sense to me, so I looked into them. This is going to be my quick review of the Broadax by Umarex. This was only $35, one of the least expensive yet most reliable Umarex air guns according to my research. All right, it has a top rail for accessories. It also has an under barrel rail for more accessories. You see the sights there, some built-in sights. It's got a safety. Now back is ready to fire, forward is safe. That right there is the mag release. All right, and it comes with three 10 round rotary magazines. You gotta push the BBs in so they don't fall out. Those are the other two magazines you see there. Now this runs on your standard CO2 cylinders and it goes in the handle. Basically you can peel off uh, one side of the handle. Now this is single or double action. As far as the accuracy of the sights that it comes with, it's pretty accurate at close range. Uh, I'm not the best shot with an air gun because uh, I haven't really been into them since I was like 10 or 12 years old, but I'm getting back into them now. But I did put some BBs through it uh, just to get a feel for it. Well, that was a heck of a lot of fun, and I think he's dead. Yeah, so you, you want to try it now? This is my backdrop. As you can see, it's more than capable of stopping a BB, and there's actually more barrier behind that, so even if it went through that board, it would still eventually stop the BB. All right, so safety first, of course. All right, here's a close-up view, and notice how windy it is. Well, I have to say, this thing is great fun. All right, in the next clip, a little more rapid fire. You see that water jug I have staked to the ground with one of my throwing spikes? Watch closely, you'll see the impacts on the target. Okay, you could hear the impacts too. Now I'm going to zoom in a little so that you can see the BB. 
Now, it might not penetrate at this range, but you will be able to see the BB all right, doing this one-handed, holding the camera in the other hand. Check this out. All right, and sorry for any background noise there. I was surprised at the accuracy from such an inexpensive air gun. Okay, next up, zoomed in trying to shoot the center of the jug and then some rapid fire. Final thoughts on this. This is a great value. This is uh, one of the best entry-level air guns, BB pistols. Before purchasing, I did read and watch all of the reviews because this is my first from this brand. And by all accounts, this is one of their most reliable models. Now, as far as hunting, um, if you have some tough critters, I would recommend something more powerful if you need some hardcore pest control. This is 375 feet per second. Now, again, if you have some tough critters, I would recommend something with more power, okay? But as an entry-level, fun air gun, target shooting, that type of thing, this thing is excellent. I mean, $35, that, that is a serious bargain. So if you're just starting the air gun part of your preps, I would definitely recommend this, right? And once you have mastered this and you're comfortable, then you can think about a more uh, high-powered, maybe a high-powered pellet pistol for pest control. And if you want to do some longer range stuff, you can check out some air rifles, maybe a compact air rifle for your bug out. In the text description box, I'll include a link to this as well as many accessories you might need, BBs, CO2, the oil, as well as some more, let's say, advanced models, including uh, some longer range models, harder hitting, and some full auto models that are legal in most places. All right, so check out those links. Those do help the channel, and I appreciate all who use them. This has been We All Juggle Knives and Air Guns. I'm out.